You may not realize it, but you are the carnival. When guests arrive, they quickly develop a first impression of the Midway. This impression is formed as they look around at the rides and concessions, as well as the employees. From the moment a guest enters the Midway, it is very important that you create a positive experience for them. To them, it is a show and you are a performer. This program will provide you with the tools to create a positive experience for guests through guest relations and the display of a positive attitude. After this presentation, you will be able to state the standards and guidelines to ensure proper guest relations. Additionally, you will be able to describe the importance of great customer service, traits of a professional carnival employee, standards for interacting with guests, and extra steps that ensure a higher than expected level of service. When you are a customer or guest of an establishment, you expect certain things such as prompt, polite, and courteous attention. You want service and respect. If you do not receive those things, or your expectations are not met, you may decide to go elsewhere. Guests expect the same of Carnival employees. They expect the same of you. Families have many options for entertainment. Carnival employees must create a positive and fun experience to ensure that families continue to attend fairs and carnivals each year. Guests will share their experience, whether positive or negative, with friends, family, and co-workers. This is known as word-of-mouth marketing, and word-of-mouth marketing is very powerful. Carnivals and fairs spend a lot of money on marketing campaigns to attract guests. This money will be wasted if they tell their friends they had a bad experience at the carnival. The mobile amusement industry and your livelihood depend on your interaction with guests. Make it a positive experience and your guests will feel good. This will help give them the best possible impression of the carnival industry for many years to come. The carnival industry has changed and continues to change. Many carnivals have specific grooming and appearance standards. More and more, carnivals are conducting initial and periodic drug testing and have substance abuse policies. Some are also doing background checks. We want you to think and be professional. Your attitude and appearance means a great deal to a guest you need to look like a professional. A professional look includes neatly trimmed, groomed, and clean hair, clean shaven, clean uniforms and personal clothing, proper footwear as required, no sandals or flip-flops, clean hands and fingernails, no visible tattoos or body piercings, no personal music devices or cell phone usage while on duty. Sunglasses in bright sunlight only. Employee identification badge worn in public view. Well rested and not under the influence of drugs, alcohol, or medication. In addition to looking like a professional, you need to possess the traits of a professional. Professional traits include Reliable and responsible. Can be depended upon to perform his or her job. Follows through on tasks he or she has agreed to perform. And arrives on time for work or appointments. Communication skills. Listens well to guests, co-workers, and supervisors. And uses language appropriate to the circumstances. Honesty and integrity. Adheres to professional and or ethical standards is honest and fair. Respect for guests, demonstrates care for guests, addresses guests appropriately, and treats guests in a polite and courteous manner. Friendly nature, demonstrates a cheerful and positive attitude, helpful to guests and co-workers. Knowledgeable, performs jobs as required, gives correct information to others, and is up to date with current policies and information. A professional will also provide prompt service, enforce rules and maintain safety, maintain a clean and orderly work environment, and take breaks to relax and recharge. Carnival work is demanding. You are on your feet a lot, you may feel pressured at times, and you stay very busy. You must ensure that you conduct yourself as a professional and always maintain a safe environment. 
Conduct yourself as a professional to guests and your fellow employees. They will respect you and treat you accordingly. Guests will see your efforts. Your actions and reactions will create the experience for them. It is what you do and say that can make that experience positive or negative. As you interact with guests, make sure that you greet them as they approach with a positive attitude and a smile. Be enthusiastic. Use clear and concise language with guests. Avoid language or terminology the guest may not understand. Ask questions when necessary to clarify the guest's needs. Do not raise your voice to a guest. Acknowledge the guest. If a guest has to wait for a significant amount of time, apologize for the wait and thank them for their time. Focus on what you can do for the guest. Appreciate all guests by thanking them for their business. Use words and phrases such as thank you, have a great time, enjoy your day, or come back soon. To maintain a safe environment, you must ensure that you are pleasant but firm when enforcing rules. Explain the rules every time you start the ride. Be alert for problems. Some of the typical rules that must be enforced include... Riders must meet posted height requirements and other rider restrictions, such as no single riders, no running or horseplay. Non-riding guests must remain outside ride boundaries and barriers. No smoking, eating, or drinking on rides. No intoxicated guests on rides. No toys, stuffed animals, or other objects that could be dangerous if dropped or thrown from a ride. Guests must remain seated with their hands and arms inside the ride. Keep a special eye on children and reassure any guest as needed. If someone argues or causes problems, shut down the ride and contact your supervisor. Watch your ride as it is in motion. If you see or hear a problem, take the appropriate action. Be sure to secure ride operation controls when you are away from the console to prevent unauthorized activation. Whenever presented with an opportunity to do more for the guest, do it. This could mean opening the door for someone, helping someone pick up a dropped item, or giving clear and easy direction. Be sure that you know the location of the show office. Be sure that you know the location of restrooms, guest services, security, and medical services. Be able to answer other questions, such as the hours of operation, or other facts as instructed by your supervisor. Reach out to guests. If someone looks lost, ask. If someone looks like they need assistance, ask. Then provide them with assistance. If you are not able to assist, put them in contact with someone who can. Help coworkers to assist guests. Work together to meet their needs. Do your best to anticipate guests' needs and questions. Your extra efforts will have a great impact on their experience. By having a proper attitude and applying these helpful hints as presented, you can create a positive experience for guests. In this program, we have discussed the standards and guidelines to ensure proper guest service. You should be able to state the importance of great customer service, the traits of a professional carnival employee, the standards for interacting with guests, and the extra steps that ensure a higher-than-expected level of service. You make the difference to a guest's experience, so that difference is up to you. When you look and conduct yourself as a professional, when you treat guests with care and respect, and when you go out of your way to be knowledgeable and helpful, everyone has a better carnival experience, and you will feel good about yourself, too.